Hello guys, I'm back. It's just King here and we're going to play The Long Dark. I'm going to play the story mode of this, it's, which is called Wintermute. The Long Dark is about a survival game. That's that's it. I, I got this game on the Epic Games Store. It was free one day. So I had to try it. I really like survival games like this. So let's see. Start a new story. Oh, it's not done yet. Okay. Mackenzie and Dr. Greenwood. I'm not gonna do that. Yeah, let's, let's do normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Name story. Yeah. I don't know. It's, it's just... <laughs> oh, it's all capital. Never mind. Okay, okay. Very nice intro, actually. That's not good. The one? Hmm. Oh. Astrid. Ah, oh, that hurts. How am I supposed to do? Twelve. Joker. Seems about right. Subtitles? <sighs> Feels like another record cold snap on the way. <laughs> wait. Wait, wait, wait. Audio. Let's play. Boom. I'd better get a fire going before the pipes freeze up again. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. How? 
Okay, okay. What else? What else? Oh, well. <laughs> whoops. Start. Start fire. Yes. Great Bear Island. Dad used to fly there all the time. He said it used to be beautiful. Not much reason to go there these days. Since the quakes and all. Uh. <laughs> right here. Here. Takes a long time to start. It's for the hangar. Okay. Yep. Some secrets over here. Best flights may be behind you, but you're still beautiful to me. And anyways, you're all I've got. I'd sure love to give you one last great adventure. Okay. Can I go here? Um. Am I not alone? Oh, whoops. This. Jackrabbit remote transport. Zero flights a day to the mainland communities and, well, anywhere really. <laughs> anywhere really. Can I take a fool? Can I? Can I? Okay. Damn, that's right. Pipes froze up again. Getting pretty late in the day. Guess you could take a nap. Take a nap? What? No. You sure take a nap. Okay, shift the sprint, alright. Oh, wait. I see. Who could that be? Why did I leave my phone here? Oh, um, okay. Jack Rabbit Remote Transport, Mackenzie speaking. I told her not to come up. I told her you couldn't fly in this weather. For once, I would not be so damn Whoa, well, slow down, Maureen. What are you talking about? She just showed up. Said you'd see her. Said you'd fly her north. I know you need the money. The weather service. It's okay, Maureen. I've got it from here. I got it from here. Uh, Hello, Will. What are you doing here? It's been a while, I know. Yeah, years. I haven't heard from you since... I know, I know. And I wouldn't be here if it weren't important. Well, what brings you... I mean, are you sick? No, no, not me. But I need to get to someone who is. Right. So you're still a doctor? Yes, I'm still a doctor. What, sir? I thought that after... <laughs> Why are you here? I need your help. There's an isolated community in the northern part of Great Bear. Someone there is very sick. Great and... Bear? There's nothing there anymore. Not since... I know. But I have to get there. Still trying to save the world, huh? Somebody has to. What's that supposed to mean? Mackenzie... Uh, Will... 
I didn't come here to fight about the past. I need a pilot to take me somewhere remote. Someone who won't ask too many questions. Someone I can trust. Wait, questions? Astrid, are you in trouble? Are you gonna help me or not? Okay. What's in the case? See, there's that thing about no questions, remember? What's in the case, Astrid? No questions. Look, the weather out there is bad. Bad. But it's getting worse. You walk in here after years. I could have been dead. You could have been. And then you show up and you want me to just risk my life flying into the middle of the great northern nowhere to deliver you and some mystery metal case to some remote wilderness outpost. All because you walked in here and asked me to? Yes. Astrid, you can't bring him back. This isn't about that. I know how hard it's been. No. You don't know, Mackenzie. You don't know anything. You don't think I feel it too? Are you gonna take me or not? The longer I wait, the worse it'll get. Damn it. Look, I don't have time for this. Wait. The worse what will get? Why do I have a feeling you're not talking about the weather? Because I'm not. Uh -oh. Is there a strange virus around? Throw your bags in the plane. I'll get started on pre-flight. Better buckle up tight, because it's going to be a rough ride. Am I going to fix the plane or something? Let's see. Two people plus enough fuel to get us out to Great Bear and back leave. Hunter Shiss. Hmm. Almost no capacity for cargo. If we're too heavy, we'll burn through our fuel before we get there. I'll have to be careful about what else I take with me. Okay. Ah. Uh... Cooking. Hi. Sure. Oh. Whiskey? No. Okay. What else can I take? Photo. Those were better days. Hmm, 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 here. Oh, oh, oh. Can't jump. <sighs> Cheap electric crap. Never works when you need it. <laughs> uh, sure. Oh, <laughs> I see. I don't remember needing my parka this early in the season. It seems to get colder every year. I can, I can. The distress pistol kit is heavy, but I'd hate to end up in an emergency situation without it. Mm. Water, energy bars, purification tablets. Breakfast of champions. Interesting. After the doctor, so we're covered there. But probably best to have some extra meds just in case. Think that's it? Okay, that's. Astrid's traveling pretty light. Wherever she's going, she must not be planning to stay long. The mysterious case. Astrid definitely doesn't want to talk about what's inside. Which means she's probably not supposed to have it. Uh how do I mm. Ah, 
No. No way. Just need to grab my parka and we can go. That's how you do it? <gasps> Wait. No, no, no. I'm stuck. I see you're still wearing it. Huh? Wearing what? Your ring. Our ring. Oh. Yeah. I mean, uh, I just forgot to take it off. Ooh. I wear mine too. Why? Memories, I guess. I thought you wanted to forget. Not all of it. Look. I, I should have looked for you. It's okay. I've kept busy. I've moved on. You sure? Because this all seems pretty familiar. You still working with that researcher? Doctor, what's his name? No. No, I'm not working at the center anymore. Well, then where? I'm working on my own. Freelance, you could say. Freelance doctor? That sounds legit. Sketchy. I your life choices, Mackenzie. Plenty of things you could be doing besides hanging out in your dad's old plane and drinking in the daytime. Hey, we had a lot of good times in this plane. And it's under control. I know, okay? I'm not here to fight, really. I think about them all the time, you know? I know you do. But I did. The choice I made. I did it for us. Like, you don't have to. Let's just not... No. It's important that you hear this. There's things I need to Mackenzie, say. Mackenzie, not now. There's... Just let me tell you. Will, shut up for a second. Something's wrong. Oh. Something's that wrong. not good. What's going on? Power's gone. The whole electrical system looks fried. Shit. What's happening? No power means we're going down. Hold tight. Going down. Use stones? What the hell? Man, here we are. This. Hmm. Ah, uh, yeah. Mm. Astrid! That hurts, buddy. I must have gone right through the windshield. Trees broke my fall. Oh, mostly. I. Huh, uh huh. But. Just for saying blood loss. How, how, how? How do I do that? Oh, okay. Blood loss. We did it. We did it. Just making my head feel thick. Uh, Burn myself. Okay, okay, okay. We can get out of here. That's not what you want. Feels like it's very cold. Oh my! What am I supposed to do? What are we supposed to do? In there? Or that? This? Oh, what?
What am I supposed to do? Can I try to climb up? Try to climb out. Oh, wait. <laughs> I see. I could probably climb that. I could probably climb that. Okay, yeah. No! Oh. Damn. There again. Okay. How do I start in fire? Fire. Fire. How oh, I start fire, caveman not know. Use fire to do the light match. Fire. Okay. How I start fire? No. None. Oh, okay. Aha, uh -huh, I see. Okay. Oh, whoops. <laughs> uh, I was supposed to make it at the cave, but I didn't. I was supposed to make it here. Ah, I see. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Sure. Okay, we made fire. Nice. Sleep? Oh, I sleep. Oh, there it is. Whoops. Astrid hasn't come looking for me. Which means she can't come looking for me. How I make because she's hurt. Or worse. How how burn burn. Better get back up to the crash site. Yes. Fire. Make fire. Come on, come on. Caveman make fire. Fire's life out. <sighs> Nice. Can I stick for the stone? Okay, I'm warm now. So climb up. Okay. Run. I can climb this now. Can't feel my hands. Oh. 
Those berries. Hmm. I can eat a horse. Interesting. Where am I? Oh shit. Could make tea. Okay. My tongue feels like sandpaper. I'm just gonna climb this, my dude. I think I'm gonna make it. Okay, we are gonna make it. Never mind. How oh, um -huh. She's dead, by the way. Wait. I'm so cold and warm up again. That's not right. My plane. Not sure which of us looks worse. Ah, poor girl. This isn't how things were supposed to end. Should I make a fire? I've been looking for you. Okay. Astrid's back. I got my jacket back. Serial code. Hmm. Locked. Whatever's in this case, Astrid was ready to die for it. I hope she hasn't already died for it. Oh, finally. Nothing else here. I should make a fire. Gotta eat soon. Well, oh. thank goodness for that. Thank goodness for that. I have for food. Okay. Yum. Yum. Okay. I'm good. That's not right. Basically, good now. Gonna wait here. Hmm. Okay, let's move. Oh, I can't jump. Oh no. Joe. Okay, no. Go off here. Huh. Flare. Break down. Okay, never mind, we're looking back. I could eat anything right now. Take torch? Ooh. Add fuel. Um, stick. I see it still. Oh. Okay. Can I? What? 
No. <laughs> no. Uh. <laughs> I see. We're gonna wait here again. Let's go. She definitely passed through here. Okay. And in a hurry. Or is she dead? No astral. Where are you? Hmm? Hmm. Rabbits. 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 No, Rafi. I'll get you next time. Oh, whoops. Okay. So she's been here recently. Could it have been Astrid? Started. Send it. Whatever. Turned out pretty well. Come on. Come on, my guy. Come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stay there, stay, stay. Come on. Stop moving. Stop right there, please. No. Hello. Please. Yes. It's horrific. That guy who drank his own pee doesn't seem so crazy right now. <laughs> cook. How how do I cook a rabbit? Rabbit. Rabbit. Mmm. Interesting. But I need a rabbit. How oh, how oh. harvest? Yes. One hour. Okay, wait. Campfire fuel. Wood wood. Okay. No. Rest. Rabbit. Ooh. Mm, mm, mm. Rabbit. Mm. What? There's more? Oh. Now we cook rabbit. No, wait. Water. Hmm? I yeah. What? This how I took there. Cool. Okay. Yes. We could wrap it. More wood. Cook 
Wait. That's right. Oh no, why? That wasn't a wolf, was it? Come on, rabbit. Stay right there. Oh. My anger was too much. I hate the stone. Hmm. 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 water. What does that mean? I don't know. Okay. Oh wait. Add more fuel. Drink. Mm mm mm. Mm. Yummy. Oh yeah. Eat. Wow, rabbit is not good enough. Okay, let's move. Hello? Anyone else here? Hello? This is wood. Hello? Oh. Fire rabbit. I think I should go over there. I need more rabbit. No. Looks like somebody went through here. No. Astrid, where did you go? Is that a wolf? That's a wolf. That's a dog. Oh, is that a wolf? I better keep my distance. Okay. I'm supposed to do that. Can they see me? Uh huh, uh huh. Stay right there, good boy. You're a good boy. Stay right there. Yeah, good boy. Good. Whoa. Whoa. Looks like some kind of radio tower. I must be closer to civilization than I thought. Huh. Huh? Climb down? Okay, I dropped my torch. Smart. And I don't know where I'm gonna go. Ah, <gasps> rabbit. 
so I'm going that way. Oh, she wait, rabbit. Just you wait. Mm, catch a rabbit. Hello. Bye bye. What? Uh huh. Okay. Oh, there it is. Ah, <gasps> another rabbit. You and your kind. <laughs> okay. find help there but abandoned uh -huh. that's it okay I should thank you or some type of ethics. should I I, that didn't work. That didn't work. Okay. Suit yourself. Sixteen sticks. It's cold. It's cold. It's very cold. Okay, can. Ow! What? What happened? But the clan is very good. Look, smoke from that chimney. I hope they they the only gonna kill me. Soul. You're right. Hello. Anyone out there? Yeah, sure. Sh just shout. Oh, that that guy. But not the bridge side. What happened here? Empty. <sighs> this whole area looks like it's been abandoned for a while. Mm. Hmm. Sure, let's let's see who's going to welcome us. Hello? Anybody here? Wait, I can't see. Um can I do it? Why can't I see? Should I? Sure. Light it up. Oh. Hello. Um. Hello. Hey. Hey, wake up. Holy shit! Uh, wait. 
Who holds your fire? Get back. O okay, okay. Just take it easy. Why are you here? I saw the smoke from your chimney. Outsider. Uh, what? Mainlander. Outsider. I don't recognize your voice. And you haven't left like the others. So, must be a Mainlander. Someone who doesn't know any better. My plane, I, I crashed in the mountains nearby. I'm looking for someone who crashed with me. A friend. She might be injured. I haven't seen her. Uh, listen, could you maybe point that gun someplace else? You think? Because my eyes are covered, I can't see you. Make the wrong move, say the wrong thing. You'll see how good a shot I am. I don't doubt it. The others. You are here. Things must be worse than they thought. Huh. Done. Who are you? Name's Mackenzie, by the way. And you are? I had a name once. But for years, the townsfolk have called me Grey Mother. The name takes on its own life. Such that at one point, the name becomes the thing it belongs to. Then the old names fade. Can only be remembered by the young and the true. How old is this lady? So, I should call you... You should call me Grey Mother also. Done. Sitting here with a rifle in your hand. Are you expecting trouble? Trouble? <laughs> trouble found me. You mean the storm? The bad men. The bad, bad men came. Took my things. Tried to take my house. They thought they were safe. Because Grey Mother can't see. <laughs> they were wrong. Bad men. Who are the bad men? The men. They... they passed through down. The night of the storm. The night of the light. I'm looking for my friend. She crashed with me when my plane came down in the mountains. Do you think she could have come through and been caught? By these bad men? I can't say for sure. Is your friend a survivor? I... Yes. She is. Then there is always hope. Her? The bad men. Did they try to hurt you? Everyone thinks being whole means you're weak. But they underestimated Grey Mother. It seems they did. Uh huh. Supplies. I crashed without much food or gear myself. And if these bad men cleaned you out, we're gonna need to find some food and fuel, or neither of us is gonna make it through the next few days. You have any idea where we could find some supplies? The bad men took everything. And the others in town who would have helped me are gone. The ones left will have their own worries. It's up to you, outsider. I'll do what I can, but I'll need your help. There must be somewhere in town to get food, fuel, the essentials. What about your friend? Are you in a hurry to find her? I'll be looking for signs of her. But there's a lot of ground to cover. 
Without gear, I won't make it. So while I'm looking for supplies, you see what you can remember about the Night of the Lights, and if she might have passed through town. That way, maybe we can help each other. Okay, outsider. Grandmother can't promise she can unlock the secrets in the dark cupboards of her mind. But she'll try. Oh, okay, there's a lot. Uh, mainland. You keep calling me a mainlander. Why? It's what you are, isn't it? From the mainland, an outsider. You don't really belong here, do you? Okay, but you sound bitter about it. <laughs> we lost everything in the collapse. People didn't realize how dependent we'd become. Some were fine with it. Others didn't want the scraps from your table. Created deep rifts in families, communities, scars that never healed. The mainland had become our lifeline and it was suddenly cut. And so, we suffered. I guess I don't know much about that history. <laughs> I'm not surprised. You mainlanders have always been focused on your own story. Only interested in Great Bear when it had something to give you. If you can't cut it down or dig it out of the ground, what use is it to you? Hmm. Empty. The town seems so quiet. Does anyone still live here? Not many. After the earthquakes, less. After last night, even fewer. Where did everyone go? That, I cannot say. All I know is that I heard screams and could smell smoke for most of the night. Huh. Okay, let's smoke on. Knowledge. Interesting. Okay, that's a lot. I should end here today. Can I get firewood from here? Eh? No. Take torch. I cannot. Thank you so much for watching for today, and I'll see you next time. Peace.